Well, what a beautiful morning here at Aintree. We're in the paddock and looking ahead to another cracking day of action on Ladies' Day. It's beautiful and sunny, as you can see. Around about six degrees, and the official going is good to soft. I just had a walk on the course, and it is perfect spring ground. And looking forward to some super action today with a number of grade one races once again. Uh, standouts, well, great to see that back in action here is John Bond, who finished second in that stellar Supreme Novices Hurdle at Cheltenham last month. He takes on El Fabiolo, and I wouldn't think Willie Mullins would be putting him in this race if he didn't think he could win it. That should be a beaut. Uh, just four turn up for the 255, the Betway Mild May Novices Chase, another grade one. Uh, those four, though, well, illustrious, certainly. Ahoy, senor, brave man's game, long presse, all top qualified uh, grade one performers and Fury Road as well for the Gordon Elliott and Ireland stable. Uh, I've got to say I'm going to go, I'm going to stick with Lon Presse who was a selection, a winning selection at uh, Cheltenham. There's just a little bit of a flavour for you for Friday morning. We have of course got the Topham Trophy coming up as well over the Grand National Fences. Uh, this one for the handicappers. Mr Coffee is the one for me in that but whatever you go with, all the best on Friday at Aintree.